The State Route 72, often nicknamed the Son of Blackbird, is the conceptual successor to the legendary State Route 71, and it's shaping up to redefine what is possible in reconnaissance and strike missions. Expected to fly in the mid-2020s, the State Route 72 pushes the limits of speed, stealth, and high-altitude operation, combining hypersonic technology with unmanned capability for missions too risky or too fast for a pilot to handle. At its core, the State Route 72 is designed to cruise at speeds up to Mach 6 that is nearly twice as fast as its predecessor. To achieve this, it uses a revolutionary combined cycle engine that switches between a conventional turbojet and a supersonic combustion ramjet, or scramjet. This unique propulsion system allows the State Route 72 to accelerate smoothly from a runway takeoff to blistering hypersonic speeds without needing a rocket boost. The main mission of the State Route 72 is intelligence, surveillance, and reconnaissance, but with the changing nature of modern warfare, it could also be configured for strike roles. Imagine a drone that could leave an enemy no time to react gathering data or even launching precision strikes deep inside hostile airspace before defenses can even detect it. Its speed alone makes interception virtually impossible with today's air defense systems. Lockheed Martin S. Skunk Works the same division that built the State Route 71 and the F-117 Nighthawk is behind this ambitious project. They be hinted at a prototype possibly flying already, though details remain highly classified. If the program stays on track, we could see an operational State Route 72 in the next few years, serving as a game changer for the US Air Force's ability to gather real-time data and execute pinpoint missions anywhere on the globe. What really sets the State Route 72 apart is the push for hypersonic speed combined with stealth and unmanned operations. These factors make it a critical deterrent in an era when rivals like China and Russia are also developing hypersonic weapons. Its development reflects the US commitment to maintain technological dominance in air superiority and reconnaissance. However, challenges remain. Hypersonic flight creates extreme heat, requiring advanced materials that can withstand temperatures that would melt conventional airframes. The engines themselves push the limits of current technology, demanding precise engineering to transition between propulsion modes. There is also the question of cost, as building and maintaining such advanced systems won't come cheap. Despite the obstacles, the State Route 72 symbolizes the future of high-speed aerial dominance. If it lives up to its promise, it will be able to fly higher, faster, and farther than anything that came before it continuing the legacy of the Blackbird while ushering in a new era of hypersonic reconnaissance and strike capability. In the coming years, watch for more details to emerge as testing ramps up for aviation enthusiasts and defense watchers alike. The State Route 72 is more than just a plane it's a statement that the race for hypersonic supremacy is very real, and the sky is no longer the limit.